vlogmas day four and y'all i am so excited y'all like when i say i'm so excited i am so excited for posting these videos and for everybody supporting me y'all are coming through and it's all love like i just love the support and i love each and every one of y'all for watching my videos sharing my videos comment on my videos i'm just very appreciative use my hair as y'all know i got my hair done but my blowouts never last and it's cold outside so we just got rock with it because i didn't want to put it in a ponytail yet so <sighs> by the title this is my unpopular opinions because yeah don't hate me y'all for what i'm about to say are y'all ready <laughs> okay Okay, y'all, that was my godmama. She's so funny. But yeah, let me get to these unpopular opinions. Y'all like my Christmas pants? <laughs> okay, not for real. First one. Y'all might hate me for this one. The white forces. The white forces. Let them go. We left them in high school. Why are y'all still wearing them? I do not like white forces for nothing, y'all. Like, and I used to have a pair all the time. Like, I used to love white forces, but then I just can't get jiggy with it no more. Like, let it go. Like, let's let's invest into something else. The white forces is not it's not it no more. Like, I don't know what it is, but and they be looking so dingy now. Let's like, leave anyway. white forces in like twenty twenty. Okay. Yeah. Number two. If y'all walk around, if y'all gonna wear forces, do not walk around with them dirty. Like, I just cannot stand that. Like, if you gonna have forces on, I really don't like them. And if you gonna walk around with them dirty, dingy, and then have the streaks tied together, squeezing your foot, y'all, y'all be looking a mess. Like, that, what are you doing? Just, let's wrap the right forces up. Like, that was so 2018, 2020. Like, let's let it go. Okay? Like, let's let it go. Next thing, synthetic hair, y'all. Let's get into it. Synthetic hair, synthetic blends, let it go. I know times be hard, times be rough. You might can't afford a little human bundle or a human, human wig. But, baby, it's not cute. It's going to tangle five minutes until you get it installed or you doing it. Like, let it go. Like, ah, the synthetic is enough for me. Y'all be letting y'all friends walk around with synthetic and hair that y'all know ain't cute? Would y'all, would y'all walk around like that? Like, oh, it's just, don't let, y'all, don't, 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 don't set your friend up for the failure to get her talked about because I'm going to look like, why? If you can't afford it, and the thing is, if you can't afford it, don't get it. Get something in your budget. Like, that's going to be cute. Because if you walk around here with synthetic hair, it just makes you look like you got synthetic hair. Like, so, yeah. Like, let's try to refrain from that going into 2024. <laughs> People love to say black girls doing their makeup and being too feminine is weird. I don't, I don't get it. Like, is it because we black, we can't wear makeup? Like, I'm just confused. Like, I feel like we, sh just how other people wear makeup every single day, I feel like we can too. Like, we're entitled to wear makeup. Like, we're, I don't know. It's not the fact that we don't feel comfortable in our skin. We just want to, like, feel glammed up. Like, and being too feminine, like, too girly. I don't understand. I don't get it. Is it because we black? Like, is it a stereotype? We can't be too feminine? I mean, I'm a little, uh, sometimes, but, like, I'm also feminine, like, I don't get it. How is that weird? Let's talk about it. Keep doing that makeup, girl, because I'm sure going to keep doing my Like, when people think of black, they automatically think ghetto. And y'all just be mad because we know how to beat our face better than some of y'all. <sighs> okay, y'all hate me or love me for this one, but ego style in jail is trash. I know that's probably y'all favorite jail, but baby, let it go. It's so bad for your hair. And it don't. Yeah, I'm going to have to keep brushing my hair through this whole video. Because what is it doing? 
the styling gel is not it like it doesn't hold your edges it like when i put it on my hair it curls up my hair like no matter if i put a little bit like i should not be putting gel in for it to curl up i like a slick back ponytail or slick up not for it to be curly and wavy i don't like that that's not cute and for the cake up in two hours okay i'm exaggerating maybe like two days if I'm the only one when I use Eco Styling Gel, like my scalp is instantly dry and like itchy, let's talk about it. It's some chemicals, but y'all keep using it though. Oh, this is my favorite when y'all be too invested in people's lives. Like I've never met somebody who who's been like invested in people's lives, but just to hear conversations and stuff. Oh, baby, y'all be too invested. Like live your life, mind your mind your business. I just can't stand somebody who who be too invested and worry about the next the next person. Like, are you mad because they doing something that you weren't doing? You not there yet? This, this is about to be funny. Natural hair. Let's talk about it. Cause people love to say, y'all can see this is my natural hair, but y'all see it's puffing up, right? Okay. And I had my blowout for three days. I see this. I have. But y'all love to get on us black girls about wearing our natural hair. You got beautiful, pretty hair. Why don't you worry about that? Because of this. Because it poofs up when I go get it done. It poofs up in three days when I go get it done. Because I have to wake up two hours early to do my hair before I get before I have to go out to do my natural hair. Natural hair out. That's why I don't know the struggle behind it. Yeah, it's cute. Yeah, I know everybody love when people with a natural hair out, but y'all, it's the maintenance. Like, I just hate when somebody said that to me because it's just like, bro, I know I have natural pretty hair, but also if it wasn't for me, like for the wigs and the braids, my hair wouldn't be this long, y'all. My hair wouldn't be this healthy. Oh, y'all, this is one of my favorite ones. Because people love to say, oh my gosh, you're too pretty to smoke. <laughs> what does me being pretty have to do with anything I do? Like, when too pretty to smoke? What? I don't know. Like, I, I don't I don't get it. Maybe, let me, comment down below what y'all think about that. Like, be kidding me. Also, people be like, oh, I'm too pretty to fight. What? You too pretty to fight, girl, please. Because if you want to tussle, bitch, we could tussle. <laughs> so, y'all, the last one. Tattoos and piercings. <sighs> With the older generation, because it's just like, they feel young people are starting to get tattoos. Y'all, I got my first tattoo at 16 years old, y'all. I have seven tattoos now. And I'm 20. So, in a matter of four years, I got seven tattoos. Okay, cool. But, like, people be so judgmental. Like, oh, you're not going to want them on your body for the rest of your life. And you're going to get tired of them. And you shouldn't have got them, baby. Listen. All my tattoos have a meaning. And if I want to ink up my body, I'm going to I'm gonna do just that. And I hate when somebody say, oh, you so, they ain't going to hide you with, you with all them piercing tattoos you got. Listen. The world is changing, okay? Like, you see people working in hospitals with tattoos. You see doctors. Well, I ain't gonna say doctors. But you see the world is changing. Like, everywhere you go, somebody has a tattoo, like, or a piercing. Like, I don't get it. And to tell me I'm not gonna get a job because of a tattoo, baby, I was never meant to work there. If you come, if you, if you gonna not hire me because of who I am and what's on me, and you're not gonna accept me for who I am, and what's on my body? Then I don't want to work there anyway. That was it for my own popular opinion. The Black Girl Edition. <laughs> Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. And co like I said, comment down below y'all. When y'all own popular opinions. Because I want to read them. I want I want to see if we're on the same page here. Let me know. Let me know what's going on. But now y'all, I love y'all so much. And I'm out. Mwah.